The world of computer science is definitely male-dominated, but as it turns out, the UW is working hard to recruit more women into this field. And the numbers show the computer science engineering department's efforts are paying off. In our graduate program, five years ago, we only had about 15% of the graduate students were women. Right now, we're at about 24%. But the program acknowledges there's still work to be done at both the undergraduate and graduate levels. I think definitely there's stereotypes. I mean, if you ask anybody in the general public, you know, what does a computer scientist look like? I think a lot of it is still the, the Dilbert cartoons. Even some of the male students agree. There's, I guess, this macho side to computing uh, where, you know, I want to have the fastest computer and play the coolest games and stuff like that. And I'm not really into that much myself, but um, I have definitely heard people talking about that. Computer science student Ellen Martin says the problem starts way before college. Men see computers a lot earlier for some reason, and I just girls don't necessarily have as much contact with them uh, at a young age, so we just don't have time to develop an interest. The CSC department agrees. It provides free videos online of successful female CSC graduates to encourage young girls to enter this field. There is such a diversity in this field of people and things that, that you can do. And I think the more that young women see that they can really help people with this um, career path, they can really make a difference. National organizations such as the ACMW give Martin a reason to be hopeful. The Association for Computing Machinery Women, uh, and so their idea is to um, increase awareness of the field to women, first of all, so do kind of the outreach part, and then uh, provide role models um, w for the women who are already in the department. To find out more, visit www.cs.washington.edu slash YCSE. Reporting from the University of Washington, I'm Anusha Goshroy for the Daily Videocast.